Hi friends, welcome to another topic in ophthalmology, cataract. Cataract is something which everyone is going to develop as we grow older. Some patients may develop it early and some patients may develop it late. Cataract is the leading cause for blindness in the developing countries. Whereas in developed countries, because cataract is treated quite early, cataract is not the leading cause for blindness. And the good thing about the cataract is cataract can be quite easily treated by surgery. So what is cataract? Cataract is nothing but opacification or clouding of the lens or its capsule. We know the lens has got different layers and this lens is there in a capsule or a bag. So any opacification of this is called as cataract and this is going to prevent the light from reaching the retina and hence it causes decrease in the vision. As I was mentioning, this is something which happens as an age-related event. So, as a part of aging, the lens will become cloudy and will lead to gradual decrease in vision. However, at what stage of cataract patient presents to us depends on the patient's visual needs. A patient who is very demanding for the vision, say for example a pilot or a person who is working on computers may present to you very soon as compared to a 90 year old gentleman who does not need much good quality vision may be happy with a very poor vision as well. So the very characteristic presentation of cataract is it's a gradual painless progressive loss of vision so generally cataract does not cause any pain and it does not cause acute sudden loss of vision and this loss of vision gradually progresses over a period of time when you examine the conjunctiva is white cornea is clear pupil is normal the lens may appear white if it is a white cataract that is the cataract has become totally cloudy or it may be gray depending on the severity of the cataract. There is no need to do any investigation to confirm the diagnosis because it's a very simple straightforward diagnosis which can be made after examination either with a torchlight or a detailed assessment on slit lamp. To calculate the power of the artificial lens that you want to put after taking out the cataract needs to be calculated using a formula. How do you treat cataract? Well, the answer is very simple. It is by surgery. There is no rule for any drops or anything to cure cataract what you do is basically take the cataract out and put an artificial lens in its place the most commonly done technique for cataract surgery is phacoemulsification which uses the ultrasound to emulsify the lens and take it out and then you put the artificial lens the anesthesia for cataract surgery can be just with the drops or it can be with the local anesthesia in the form of a block around the eye or it can be performed under general anesthesia. So when you look at these three pictures, obviously the one on your left hand side is a white cataract that is it's a very advanced cataract and patient will not be able to see anything. Whereas in the middle, it's not black cataract, it is clear cornea and clear lens. 
so this is what a normal eye looks like whereas a picture on your right side you can see some white spot there that is a type of cataract so it's not as advanced as uh, the image on the left side so this you are seeing after the pupil has been dilated However, the middle picture shows a normal pupil. Hope you liked this presentation on cataract, which was a very simple and straightforward.